In this video, we will understand the theorems related to the areas of parallelogram and triangles. Let's continue with the first one. Theorem 1 states that parallelograms on the same base and between the same parallels are equal in area. Consider two parallelograms ABCD and EFCD on the same base CD. We need to prove the areas of these two parallelograms are equal. To prove this, consider two triangles ADE and triangle BCF. Since opposite sides of parallelogram are equal, therefore side DE equals side CF and side AD equals side BC. Angle DAE equals angle CBF as corresponding angles are equal if lines are parallel. Therefore, by SSA criteria, triangle ADE is congruent to triangle BCF. Since area of congruent triangles are equal, therefore area of triangle ADE equals area of triangle BCF. From figure, area of parallelogram ABCD can be written as the sum of area of triangle ADE and area of quadrilateral BCDE. Using equation number 1, area of triangle ADE can be written as area of triangle BCF therefore right hand side of this equation becomes area of triangle BCF plus area of quadrilateral BCDE from figure the sum of triangle BCF and area of quadrilateral BCDE forms area of parallelogram CDEF hence area of parallelogram ABCD equals area of parallelogram CDEF hence the theorem is proved moving on to the next theorem second theorem states that two triangles on the same base and between the same parallels are equal in area Consider a parallelogram ABCD. Let AC be the diagonal on it, resulting in the formation of two triangles ABC and triangle ADC. Since opposite sides of parallelogram are equal, therefore side AD equals side BC and side AB equals side CD. AC is the common side to these triangles and hence it is equal. Therefore, by SSS criteria, triangle ACD is congruent to triangle ABC. Since areas of two congruent triangles are equal, therefore area of triangle ACD equals area of triangle ABC. From figure, the area of parallelogram ABCD is the sum of area of triangle ACD and triangle ABC. Therefore, area of triangle ACD can be expressed as half of area of parallelogram ABCD. This equation is also an important result area of triangle that states is half of the area of parallelogram formed on the same base and between the same parallel lines. Since area of parallelogram is equal to the product of base and height, construct AE perpendicular on side CD acting as height of the parallelogram ABCD. Therefore, this equation becomes area of triangle ACD equals half into CD into AE. As side CD equals side AB, Therefore, this equation becomes half into AB into AE which forms the area of triangle ABC. Hence, area of two triangles found between the same parallel lines and having the same base are equal. Moving on to the next theorem. This theorem is the converse of the previous one and states that two triangles having the same base and equal areas lie between the same parallel lines. Consider two triangles ABC and triangle ADB on the same base AB such that area of triangle ABC equals area of triangle ADB. Draw CE perpendicular AB and DF perpendicular AB acting as altitudes for triangle ACB and triangle ABD. Join point C to point D. We need to prove that segment CD is parallel to segment AB. Since lines perpendicular to the same line are parallel to one another, therefore segment CE is parallel to segment DF. As area of triangle ABC equals area of triangle ABD, therefore side CE is equal to side DF. Since opposite sides are parallel and equal, therefore quadrilateral CDFE is a parallelogram. Hence segment CD parallel segment AB. This was it for the video. See you in the next one. Thank you for watching.